Evening all, it's another workout of the week. Uh, this week we're going to be doing a barbell only workout, so let's get cracking. So the first circuit, we are going to do everything with the weights, whatever weight you select, just on one end of the barbell, the other end just try and make sure it's anchored somewhere reasonably sensible or on a nice rubber floor like we've got here at the upstairs studio. So you're going to do a reverse lunge into a one arm press, making sure that, that the, uh, the arm that's taking the weight is on the same side as the leg that's going back to really challenge the core, you'll do 30 seconds on that right leg to right side press and then left leg to left side press. 30 seconds on that side as well. So this is a great uh, great workout to do if you've got a gym membership but um, things get a bit crazy, a bit busy in the gym and you only want to use one piece of kit. It's a great way of basically monopolizing that barbell. From there we're going to go into landmines, swinging side to side, soft knees, soft hips, push the glutes back and keep it right in the middle of the chest. And 30 seconds of those. Then you're going to step over the top of the bar and you're going to move into a barbell straddle row. So this is to work the back, a lot of those postural muscles, the core's working hard as well. So make sure you're squeezing the shoulder blades right back, squeezing across the middle back, not letting the shoulders round upwards uh, to really work on that area across the middle back. Okay, you're going to do that around that and you can do three to five rounds of that depending on how much time you've got. So second circuit, we're doing a squat to overhead press. So you can either start with the bar at shoulder height or rack it up like I did there. Um, so you're going to do the squat with the bar sitting on the chest and then use the power from the squat to press the bar overhead. Again, for any um, women watching this that aren't quite confident with the barbell, you don't need to put any weight on it. It weighs 20 kilograms on its own, so this will be enough of a workout. From there, you finish the last press. You're going to take the, uh, the overhead. You're going to take it behind the shoulder, so behind the head, and then go into these alternating reverse lunges. Great exercise for the glutes and the core uh, and the, uh, the, the thighs as well. It gets a really good workout. Get everything working really hard on that. And then the last exercise on this circuit, we are going to take the bar back down onto the floor. So again, you can walk it into the rack um, and move it around that way. But if you're if you're confident enough, then just press it overhead, bring it down via the chest. Then you're going to go into barbell rollout. So on the knees, rolling the bar outwards, keeping the core locked in. This is a core exercise. You're also going to feel it uh, across the shoulders. But the main point you want to feel here is the abdominals are lengthening and they're under tension. You're going into an extended plank and then drive the arms back down until the bar taps to your thighs. Keep the head in line with the spine there, make sure it doesn't go anywhere else. And that's that, do that on second circuit as many times around as you can, three to five sets. 